friends, my name is Smish, and welcome back to No, That's Not a Potato in My Pocket, I Just Have the Plague. I have four hours to do everything. God damn it. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Okay, let's go. Let's go. First to Grace, because we're right over here. Come on, go, 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 go. Fuck, I don't have... Hey, Mukao, you're back! What are you here for? Hey. Oh, look who's back! How, where have you been? Back a boy, have you brought me anything? Well, uh, if you knew where, if I knew, if you knew what went on here, you wouldn't come back, or is that exactly the reason? I like you, yeah. Thank you, partner. Whoops. Alright, let's go. Uh-huh. Well, yeah, probably. Grace, I hope you have water near your house. That'd be really great if you did. Because I need it. Like, really, really badly. Really badly. This way. <laughs> What's this? Because of the outbreak, we have nowhere to bury dead corpses. Corpses are just dumped in the cemetery. Grace forbids burning. Oh, good. I'm sure that's not terrible. Grace! Honey! I think you should let people get buried. I don't know where it's talking about bodies being... Is this, is this, is this what it's talking about? Bodies? You don't look like a body. Hi. How are you? I don't know. Gotta go. Or is it just outside? Out. Out. Fuck it. Out. Grace! Grace, stop dying! Stop doing your thing where you talk to dead people. Stop seeing dead people all the time. <laughs> you work in a graveyard. Grace! Grace, I'm dying of thirst, but I'm here to save you. Stop it. The grave diggers are you! Scattered. You brought new bodies, didn't you? Please, Four, enough! Stop they? bringing them here! There are so many I can- I can barely hear! Our grave's overflowing? Imagine 50 people crammed into this room. You can't bend your knees, can't turn, can't scratch your back, can't even shrug. The last- uh, it lasts for days. How would you feel? It's torture. They feel nothing, kid. They're dead. Do they hurt? Earth is cramped. No more space. They trample each other. All They wail. I, they don't care anymore, kid. Then we need to- we must bury them. There's no other way. Burn them or, or they'll smother you. No! No burning! Then you won't be able to talk- they won't be able to talk to us. And the last thread will tear. Hope itself will dissolve. They'll be gone forever, can't you see? But they're already dead. They can't feel anything. Something has to be sacrificed. Better them than you. No! They care, they feel, and there's no peace for them now. That's all they need. Consolation and peace. There's no one more miserable, more helpless than dead. Can't you see that? You're imagining, Grace, perhaps, but the living are more important. So that's why you're coming apart the seems Too many dead to console? Too many! All, all of them so cold. You don't, you don't believe me, do you? Go and listen. Go and see, listen to those huge graves. They dump people there by the dozens. All right, sweetie, just stop, stop, stop crying. It's too crowded underground. The dead are shrieking. I can even I can hear if I try. Okay, well let's go over there. Over this way. Ew! Whoa! Oh wow! Cold, icy, cold, icy, cold, cold. You can really talk. You can really talk. Has Grace given me the power to see, you hear you somehow? Oh, call all oh, cold, icy, icy. I lacking, clad in cold. Is Isdor among Burke among you? See, so definitely cramped, cold, pin driven away by fire. <laughs> call one, call all, all one, all. I'm sorry, I asked. None of you are alone over there. You're pretty cramped. You need warmth. It's too crowded in the ground. Nice meeting you once again, my dear hometown. If I burn the grave, this will stop for sure. But should I? Grace! Oh, hi. What? Do you want to hear, human? How many dead do you think are down there? More than I would like. Any other questions? Is it possible to relocate some of them somewhere else? Are the dead truly uncomfortable down there, or does it only seem that way to the living? 
You'll know when you're dead. How do I stop their screaming? It can be arranged. It would be my pleasure. Should I make it less crowded? You can... How are you going to arrange that? Safe and sound. So, I'm not a town hall clerk awaiting your orders. Cremation would destroy them. You maybe not. Go ahead, work your... Do your magic. Do it for Grace's safety. One moment. Another. Oh, so many of them. So many indeed. That's it. All done. What did you do exactly? I solved your problem. Got what you came for. Did you? You did? I'm not dropping this. What did you do? Whoever laid right of me better not think of them. But those who are left, but those to the left, they are fine now. Do you understand me, human? Go, human. I didn't understand any of that. What was that? A hallucination? Was it devoured? Has it devoured the dead? How exactly? What kind of trickery is it? Okay, well, Grace! Um, are you okay? Because I got a lot of stuff I gotta do. I gotta check on you first. Grace! They're not. Hi. Will I be interrogated? It's quieter. Well? well, are you happy now? They are scared. I feel like something terrible has happened, but I don't understand. They're silent. They stopped talking to me. Do you know about the creature who lives underground? Looks like... It looks like a rat. There are no creatures underground. Only the earth and the dead among becoming earth. The earth and dead are the same, connected through all the shard of life. Uh, the life they shared. Thought so. Uh, it seems I've... Mm, I thought so. Oh, what does that mean? Dead no longer smother Grace. She's unhappy about it. I'm fine having offended her so long as she's alive. Uh, yeah. Fuck it. I don't care. Yeah. No. Honey. Hey, Dip. Yes. Dora, the explorer. We spoke to the girl. How is she? I think she, it's better that we leave her alone for now. I came to take her away to... The town hall is finally ready to find her a normal place to live. Are you sure that's a good idea? Of course. Is there any doubt? Grace is an unusual girl. She's different than the other kids. Uh, she's an erotic kid. Moving her to a different place could traumatize her. The, towns, uh, the townsfolk respect her. If Grace were removed from the cemetery, chaos would ensue. That's the last thing we want right now. Oh, come to your senses, Dr. Burke. Do you even know the girl's name? It's Grace. Grace. It's a, it's a nickname. She's nameless. She has no documents. Her father or mother were twin drinkers and they never bothered. She can't read or write. Eats whatever she picks off the ground. It's She's like a living weed. Why do you call her weed? Precious herbs grow in the cemetery too. There are lots of orphans and urchins in town. What's one more? You're right. I don't know what got into you. But what if she likes it here? What will become of her if she grows up? Or, oh, is this is simpler, in winter when it drops below zero. Here, the only path ahead of her is the one that leads right into the grave soil. There's nothing wrong with the soil. Leave Grace alone. So I'm taking her. Still no! Yeah, go fuck it. Fuck off! Grace! I saved you. I love you. I don't know. I feel like you'd be happier here. Doop. Okay. We have a lot of things to do. Maybe, mm, maybe... No. There wouldn't be water over there because everything's infected. Fuck. My life. Hardcore. Fuck. Okay. Alrighty. Well, we're gonna go over here. Uh, help? Grace. Fine. Aspie's in danger. Everybody's in danger. There are so many people in danger. It's not even fucking funny. Fine, Aspie. Aspie, come here. I guess. Um, hold on. Let me... Where's my... There's a save point somewhere. Fuck it. Aspie. Here, I guess. Um, I have, I have three of these. Here, take this one. Immunity shit. I hope you don't get poisoned. Oh, here. 
Hope we don't get poisoned and die. We might. We could die of thirst. And fucking fantastic. Gotta go this way. People are gonna get fucking die. Um, but maybe if I played smarter and had more shit. Oh fuck. God damn. Oh, I have this, but I don't have. I can't. I can't thirst that right now. Fuck. Fuck. Damn it. God, why are all the things that I fixed, like, in plague area? This is irritating as fuck. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, that's fine. We're almost there. We almost... Fuck, I gotta, I gotta help Griff, though. I gotta help Griff. Griff! Griff! Griff, I'm gonna need you... De... Not die. Fuck, Natkin! Well, I'm right across the way from Natkin. Might as fucking well. God damn it. Griff! Here! Um... Yeah. Trade... If only I knew how much food things were. Guess I'll take two. I don't fucking know. It's a lot of money. Griff, you're a fucking asshole. Here! Take it! Take it! Take it! Take it! Take it! Take it! I love you, so that's why I'm giving you the really good stuff. Can you have something in here? No, cause you're a giant ass dick! Fuck! Shit! Shit! It's getting dark! God damn it! Ah, shit, 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 shit. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I got it, I got it, I got a Nodkin. I gotta help Nodkin. I don't, I don't, I don't. Fuck! Alright, 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 Nodkin! Nodkin! Give medicine! What the fuck is this? A box filled with powder made of assorted ground pills, extremely harmful, but somehow cures a pet. It cures it? Wait, hold on. Notkin? Notkin's fine! Oh my god! How do you feel, buddy? Oh my god, yes! Ah! Oh, you beautiful, beautiful child! Hi! You don't have anything I can use. Okay, that's fine. Oh, yes! Natkin is healed! Yay! Oh my god, if one good thing came out of the day, it's that. Ah, oh, shit. Um, we're gonna use this. Use. Oh, beautiful health. Thank you. Because I'm dying of everything. Oh, shit. Um, use this. There we go. That'll just get us through this pesty area. And then we can go. Back. Shit. For once, I'm actually considering drinking the nasty water. Damn it. I need to fix more pumps. I need to fix, like, all the goddamn pumps. All of them. Ah. Uh. Oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. Fucking shit. Okay. 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 What we're gonna do is run over to there. We're gonna... Oh, Notkin's cured. Notkin's fucking cured. Yes. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Okay. So anytime you can get those damn boxes, fucking get them. Trade, like, everything out of your goddamn pockets for them. I don't fucking care. Because if you get somebody who's infected, that's what you gotta do. Okay, okay, okay. We're almost to a place with some blub blub water. It's fine. It's almost- it's fine. It's fine. We can get something to drink there. It'll be great. We can fill up all of our water. Where am I? What's going on? Water, 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 water. <sighs> a pump! I can fix you! I can fix you! Oh my god! Oh god, yes! 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 Holy shit, yes! Oh my god, yes! I'm gonna fill up every single water thing that I have because fuck! Ah, uh, that sweet, sweet not dying of dehydration. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, hold on. I can, I can eat my toast. I can eat my toast. Okay, here we go. And one more- one more drink. Ah, yes. Fuck yes. Fuck yes! Okay. Alright, we're getting fucking somewhere. Okie dokie. Oh. Oh, beautiful, beautiful stuff. I'm just so dying. I'm dying of- I'm dying. I'm just dying. Oh, I need to go to the Inquisition. Um. Okay. Two go to the place. You can't do anything because you're fucking on the wrong side of the street. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck everything about you. Okay. Um, I guess we need to go talk to the goddamn Inquisitor. Hopefully this won't take up too much time, because I still gotta fucking go to over this way. Hi. 
Please don't take up too much of my time. I still gotta go to the hospital. Ugh, I gotta go to the hospital. Hi! Yeah, it's a big empty place. Um, is there a safe spot here? What the fuck? Can I, I climb up here? What is this? What? 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 Is this nonsense? Save? Save spot. Fucking anywhere. Save spot. What? Oh. I guess this whole place is a giant fucking clock. Okay. Oh wait. There's more up? There's more up. I just saved so I don't care. I can I can always unsave. Um the back is this. What the what the Uh Ooh. Can I touch this? Can I touch it? Can I, can I touch? I, I touch. I touch? Hmm. Doesn't want me to touch. What if? Can I do something stupid? Can I? Can I? Ah! I'm not even mad. Hi. Please don't be no too bad at my decision. Uh, at please don't think here. about capturing agony. I'm not the kind to burn models alive in an attempt to write truthful suffering. My interests lie elsewhere. It's not about cruelty or the inevitability of the end or the triumph of death. Uh, all of this is the only reason and excuse. Then what is your play about? I, I was dead. Now I'm alive. Wh who are you to come and talk? Undoubtedly, it's about the person, the actor. I'm not an actor. I'm Albert Burke in the flesh. Open your eyes, clown. I need different actors to continue the same path, each starting where the previous died, so their interpretation of the character carries on. Here's my question. When, when does the actor become the character when they get into character, when they sympathize with them? I read, I read that in the book once. The actor goes to the town searching for inspiration or role. He walks down his, this path, his path. That's where, what you're talking about. What to do? Why do I need, why do this in town? Why not where their theater where you can see it? Because outside the walls of the theater, the triumph of death is real. That's why you must act, not here. Why isn't sage enough? Because I don't care about your emotions, only your understanding. If you, if the actor understands how the work, how to work with death, so will others like me. Don't worry, though. In truth, that what you see here is, is on stage two. It's all also a model, like the one background behind me. Spare me your cheap philosophy. What do you want? What do I want? A good play! No one's ever staged this one before. You must break away from your limits. I'm interested in that too. Push your limits to the theatrical stage of drama, of form. Push the actor beyond their role. The play itself beyond the sorry theater. And that our goals align. Wish you luck. I don't believe. Good luck. Well, I died. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't see that coming. I don't... Yeah. I know. It was a bad decision. It was a very bad decision. It was beyond bad. And yet, I did it. Do I feel sorry about it? Okay. Hi. A murder. <sighs> this will be a long conversation. You must pay complete attention. Do not... you. Don't need to tell the truth, but lying will have consequences. Ready? Well, I'd like to take a seat first. Looks like I'm in for something interesting. So this is what the Inquisitors are like. Not what I expected. To face consequences, I am. You're that... Are you that cynical or that brave? Eh, you don't seem like a fool. Eh, that's not for me to judge. I'm... I am, first and foremost, exhausted. We've been, we've seen too much over the last week for me to be afraid of you. Let us start with a classical problem. Would you push an obnoxious fat man in front of a trolley to keep four children from being run over? It's not a problem, it's a provocation. I see. Question two. Soldiers are about to execute your two daughters. 
If you offer them one voluntarily, they will shoot her. If you refuse to cooperate, they'll shoot them both. You move. Look, why do you ask me this? It's not like... It's not what you really called me here for to talk about. I can't t make such a choice unless I'm truly faced with the situation, God forbid. They'll kill everyone anyways. I won't cooperate. I'll choose one daughter. I have no daughters. Should we maybe get down to business? You are an intriguing man, Albert Burke. Your speech has an unusual cadence to it. Very thing indeed. Uh, but I believe I have now attuned myself to you. Do you know why I'm here? I can guess. I've been told that you are well versed in the local lore and medicines. This is useful, uh, with its useful, unusual beliefs about human body. I have been told that you are working on a cure for the d disease and that there, there is there can be no cure. This is merely a sabotage. Am I correct? What? Who told you that? So can you cure, produce a cure or not? I don't know. I'm starting to suspect I can't. It would it require a creature that does not exist. An hour ago, I was brought a vial with a, and a letter from one uh, Reuben. He claims the medicine tested is a tested serum, the serum, and that the town owes you its existence to you. Any comment? But that can't be. He doesn't have skill. So that's what he was doing. I've also been informed that he was a close friend of yours. You know what happened to him? Reuben died tonight. Have you not heard? I only know he's dead, nothing more. Doesn't matter now. Uh, what matters is why he sent the sample on your behalf rather than on his own. I don't know, he was acting a bit strange of late. I think he wanted to make up for his outbursts. Passing the torch to me, so to speak. A cure for the sand pest changes many things. Thousands of lives and deaths, questions of which I am now interested in. Four. I, now I need the recipe and access to ingredients. Show me. Which four lives are you concerned with? I don't have a recipe ready. Ingredients will be an issue. I don't know where to get them. Burke, are you mad? I don't believe you fully comprehend who I am or what is happening right now. Is that so? Let's deal with the epidemic first. Bicker later. What, what is this sample made of? Blood mostly, herbal tinctures, but also, uh, but those are secondary. We are, we're lucky it's September. Twern is in blossom. Affected human blood? No, no, no. I don't know whose blood it is. If you, if I did just hear you, Burke, I'd assume you were trying to make fun of me. Allow me to reciprocate. Then, did you, did you know that the whole ordeal uh, with divining your fate is more than a mere mystical, my, mystical nonsense? Your fate has been amputated. I can tell that for certain. Perhaps I don't really care. <sighs> what do you mean? Are you that apathetic, or is it just simply you don't understand how painful, how painful it is to remain a puppet in the hands of those more powerful than you? Act on what I believe is my duty. If someone tries to use my actions for their own ends, I don't care. I always just try to do the right thing. I don't care if someone ostrich uh, orchestrates or not. The heart is smarter than the brain. You are a fool. Although perhaps you're not the fool here. Go! This conversation is over. So there will be more at some point. I'm looking forward to it. Don't give me the cheek, Burke! I don't have it. You are to report to me here daily. Any more quips or are we done? I'm good for now. I understand. Report daily. Will do. I have got I've got one more. I've got more, but I think I can hold them back for a bit longer. See you around. That is M. What's this? We have a cure. It cost Ruben his life, so now he won't be able to tell me what he made it from. How can I make more? I need advice from someone well-versed in blood. Ruben is dead. Uh, and I think I know who is responsible for this. Wee! Hey! You're an asshole. Alright, we're gonna run across, we're gonna save, and then we're gonna try and figure out our life. Like every other day. Well, I have a lot of people. I have two people who might die. And I have several people 
who may get infected. Okay, onward. We need to go talk to Blade. Hopefully he's not pissed about me and me with the chemist. Okay, this way. Chemist! No, wait. Vlad! Vlad! Hey, Vladdy Poo! So, you say you know how to connect things, which is why you cut, rip, and break them. Like a father. Reuben made a cure for the sand pest. He made it from some strange blood, and you know a lot about blood. Reuben? Who's Reuben? My father's apprentice. Didn't he come to you? Lots of idiots found their way into Isdor's circle. Although I guess not all of them were completely stupid. Uh, so he made a cure, huh? For sure? From blood? So it's the price, so that its price will rise. No, it was special blood. Human won't do. That chance, blood's only getting cheaper these days. A cure, huh? You're a big talker. What does a smart ass like you want from me? Advice? Here. If you tell on me uh, to that unholy wench, I'll claw my way out of hell and drag you back down. Got it? Got it. Like, she needs you. Just tell me. Tell me, has anyone ever brought you unusual blood? I won't tell on you, and in return, you'll tell me where to find all the, mo the most unusual blood in this town. Her brides danced in the earth with at the ear. D did you did you know? To make twern bloom better. Cover themselves in some sort of mud, and they call it blood. Um, you could probably pick up a sample of it if you want. I bet you haven't yet tried to brew a cure from mud, huh? Ha 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 I'm asking a serious question, and you just want to joke about it, damn it. You know what? I'll pay them a visit. Don't suppose I'll ever find out what Reuben made his cure from, but strange blood seeps into the ground by the ear. Sheik the ear. Okay. That's way the fuck over there. I gotta go to the hospital first. Alright, we're gonna make our way to the damn hospital. Way to F over here. Fastest way to the hospital? I've been around. Okay. I'm not that far. I can make it. Hopefully I can do everything that I need to do there. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, I'm dying of everything. I got exhaustion and hunger on my ass. God damn. Ugh. Ugh. Ow. Back. Oh, shit. Okay. Okay. Um, let's see. Uh, talk. Uh, do you plan on working today, doctor? Uh, and you are? Uh, uh, Gregory Gorky, doctor, a coal heaver, I am Kane's man. Volunteer? Well, kinda, I guess. If you yoke yourself to, to death's plow, you might as well claim you've done some voluntary. Hurts your dignity less. <sighs> What's the job today? Lots of patients died last night. They moaned for a while, and then they stopped. I guess some are still breathing, nestling sex to corpses, twitching. You can't tell anymore. Turn this hospital into a morgue! Don't raise your voice at me! It's a theater, not a hospital! I'm a coal heaver, not a doctor! No one ever taught us how to fight the plague. She's cunning minx, mixing the dead with the living into one. One day, she's silent, the next she mows down a hundred. She'll mow down- she'll mow your folk down too, mark my word. And we're just doing our best. Won't mow mine down, I'll take care of them. So what are your orders? Ugh, prepare the bandages in warm water. I bring the survivors. You'll need they'll need to wash them. Okay. They need to find the not dead people, I guess. Against the dead people. Uh, do I have anything ow fuck. Is there anything in here? No, I didn't even get anything. God damn. Oh here's one. Hi, move you to the hospital. Okay, well there's one. Okay. Um. Hi. Give medicine. Um. Here. Back. It doesn't help me, and I don't have a lot of shit. Here. Here. Take this. Oh, good. Um. Here. I guess you're gonna have this. Good job. Okay. So that's one that not dead. Ow. Hold on. I just Fuck. Here. I'm gonna use this on myself because fuck you.
Ow. Ow. Fuck. Oh god, no! I need to find more not dead people. Ugh. Where are the not dead people? Not dead, not dead, not dead. Where are you? Oh shit. Oh shit. Well, that was a bad idea. Okay, I guess I'm going here. Except I'll be back. Okay, good. I've got a coffee bean from that guy. Whew. That makes my life better. Okay. Hey, kid. I really could use a fingernail because I had to trade two of them to that bastard. But at least I'm not dying of everything right now. Fuck me. <sighs> uh, shit. Okay. Well, we just gotta make our way back to everything. Okay, back to the back to the hospital. Here we go. Here we go. We're getting fucking somewhere, guys. Now we're getting somewhere. Oh yes. Look at that beautiful. Not dying. And it's so great. It's so great to not die. Ooh, hi. Give me. Except, good. Now I have two fingernails again. Because I apparently need two of them now to go on a boat. Because they're fucking assholes. Okay. Gotta go back into the theater. Talk to the what's his fuck. Which I'll skip that. Because I already talked to him. Okay, I know where one is. I don't have time to heal them, though. Um, here. Move. Shit. Fuck. Move, move. Shit, 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 shit. Apparently, it's probably upstairs. It's probably upstairs. I gotta go. Go, 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 go. Move, move, move. If they're not upstairs, I don't know. <gasps> oh, here. Here's one. Two. Move. Move, move, move. Okay. Is the other one around the side? Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. There. There. Where? Where, 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 where? Here. Here. Did it! Oh, I got them all. Fuck yeah, I did my job. Do you feel your forehead warming? Yes! I do. I do, actually. Okay. Okay. And now, and now I can work on kind of healing you. Um, give medicine. Yes! I'm so ever fucking smart. <laughs> um, where did the sick- Here we go. Give medicine. All right, start with you. Ooh. Boop. Yes. Okay, we're gonna give this to you. Here you go. Here you go. You'll feel better. Don't worry about it. Ah, yeah. Isn't that nice? Well, I don't have anything else to test it with, so. Yes. Ah, oh, I am so fucking smart. I am so goddamn smart. Look at my goddamn smartness. Okay, I. <sighs> Son of a fucking bitch. So I know. So this is fever. It rises with any of the three. So there's there's um, the three layers here. Um, I, I realize that there are new people here that aren't always here for me doing stuff. Fever is the fucking worst because it means it could be anything, and I don't have anything else to test with right now. So I'm just gonna leave this guy fucking alone because um, I don't have any extra medicines to try and even guess. Which of these three? So literally, it could be anything. So it's all color coordinated. So you use some of the bottles of liquid that you make from the weeds um, or herbs, and then you'll use them on a patient. It raises their pain level, um, and uh, you you can't let it get all the way up, or else um, then it it won't be as effective. Uh, so you got to mitigate pain with. Um, curing them and the bottles use uh, cause pain but then once you figure out which of these three layers or get close enough to where you can maybe even guess which antibiotic it is you give the color coordinated antibiotic to the people that need it and then um you can then uh lower their infection you can give them the wrong color antibiotic but it won't be very effective and it's just kind of a waste of materials at that point So I guess the next closest thing... Ah, because I forgot to go talk to him. Fuck. Please don't be over by the end of the evening. I have to make my happy ass all the way fucking back there. Oop. Nighttime. 
Royd waits you at the fund. If you don't claim it before tomorrow evening, it will be distributed among the poor. Fuck the poor! <laughs> Alright, who's died and or got infected? Oh, good. Ah, Griff. Oh, shit. I didn't... Oh, you got lucky, bitch. You got way lucky. You're not dead. Good for you. Sticky? Oh, thank God, Sticky. You're not dead. That's good. Oh, shit. Oh, you're gonna be infected. Yep. You're infected. Damn. But Natkin's fine, guys. Natkin is fine. This... You had 12 days. Yeah. Not so many. Fund. Sometimes dark things. Kids evening. Um, but I mean, I'm at the theater. Might as well fucking see here and maybe the dead drop won't be forever the fuck away from me. Your face stirs within the theater. Yeah. I don't know. Oh, God. This is I wanted to apologize for the lie. I did, but still... I lied. Betrayed his trust. Betrayal means death. What? Next. I cheated on my wife, but thing is, we've been together for... Cheating Holy. is betrayal. Betrayal means death. Please stand to the left. Oh my god. Next. Listen, I understand where this is going. I beg you, forgive me. I'm guilty of betrayal too, but I will never again... Death. Next. Jesus. See, the circumstances were. I never wanted to betray them. But death. Look, is there anyone here with a different crime? There are no other crimes. There's no such thing as evil, murder, torture, or violent abuse. The only real crime is betraying someone who trusted you. So everyone who has that kind of confession Please stand to the left. Your punishment is death. What the fuck? End of discussion. The fuck? Bullshit. Predator's fucking stupid. Oh, god damn it. Infection is here. I just wanted to get something from the dead drop. Is that too much to ask? Is that too much? Ow. It's been two nights since I was able to go to the dead drop. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, you're a murderer person. I don't like you. Go away. Go the fuck away. Over here without him seeing me. Without him seeing me. There we go. There we go. Very nice. Very nice. Hey, this isn't playing piano music anymore. Oh shit. Shit. Shit! No! Where did they come from? No! That's not fair! Oh god, I have to play so much shit all over Ooh, again. Today is just dress rehearsal. Your burden is heavy, aren't me? How do we show that? Imagine rolling boulder uphill, muscles trembling. What do you feel? Unbearable exhaustion. Fuck. Without the boulder. That you're tricking, trying to trick me. Well done! Entire, not, but not entirely untrue. Not now. <sighs> if anything makes me exhausted, it's this circus of yours. <sighs> you walk his path, Burke's path, and it's not very difficult. Each step drains your strength. Yes, I get it. I'm okay. Not my style. As a doctor, I agree. All organisms need rest. Food for thought, overcome weakness, must my knowledge, you agree. Step towards death, I think I understand. I, yeah, please don't have lowered my health too. Shit. It was not my fault. It was not my goddamn fault. Fuck. Well, friends, that was Pathologic 2 Part 19. Everything's fucking stupid. God damn it. I'm gonna have to play up and get back to that point and shit like that. Um, so I'll get up to after the day shifts and try and figure out my fucking life. Um, if you like this episode, please hit the like button. If you dislike this episode, please hit the dislike button because honesty is always the best policy. If you want to see more content like this, please hit that subscribe button and I will see you all in the next video. Bye, Mies!